Hi there, it's Ivan and you are watching Puzzle Guy channel. Probably you've noticed that in the last couple of weeks I become a little bit lazy and I skip Wednesday videos uh, this week and previous week. And that's because sometimes I'm losing motivation to make videos. I don't lose motivation to solve puzzles, that's what I like to do now, 24 hours, uh, 7 days a week. But sometimes I don't have, have enough motivation to make videos. Since I get a lot of comments uh, like, dude, you have a nice channel, I'm wondering why you're not as huge as some other channels on YouTube. And I have no idea why it's happening like this. Probably it's up to YouTube how they promote videos of different channels, but I don't think that I can do anything with it. Probably you can help me uh, by liking my videos, leaving comments, subscribing if you're not subscribed yet to my channel and sharing my videos with your friends. And now let's get back to puzzles. Uh, this Wednesday I wanted to make unboxing video, uh, as I always do when I get puzzles from Puzzle Master, but since I was a little bit lazy, I didn't uh, make this video, but I will show you uh, all puzzles that I got from them. They're right here. And as you can see, like it's a lot of puzzles, 17 to be exact. And uh, I've got uh, maybe three or four puzzles from Robrecht, a couple of puzzles from Vinko, um, three puzzles from Oscar van Deventer, and some other puzzles. And if you want to know more about these puzzles, I will put links in the video description as always, and at the end of the video I will show you uh, them again. And now uh, I think that uh, I'm going to choose one of these puzzles to solve, and I will start with the puzzle that has interesting name, Escape from Alcatraz. Uh, I like how this puzzle looks and I like the name of the puzzle. And uh, probably you've noticed that this time I have a lot of maze puzzles, since I like maze puzzles a lot. And uh, all Robrecht puzzles, they are usually based on maze, so that is why I'm gonna solve one of them today. So, as I told you, the name of the puzzle is uh, Escape from Alcatraz. It has difficulty level 8 out of 10, and the object is to remove one euro coin uh, from the puzzle. And as you can see, this uh, hole where you can see the coin is a little bit smaller than the coin itself, and you can't remove it here, so there is, there is another way how you can uh, do it, and you have to find this way how to remove the coin. If you like Escape from Alcatraz puzzle and you want to buy it, link is going to be in the video description. And if you want to see my attempt to solve the puzzle, keep watching the video. Okay, let's try to solve the Escape from Alcatraz puzzle. I'll start my stopwatch first and let's try to figure out the way how to remove one euro coin. So there is an inner part here and I can move it, but that's it. I can't move it anymore. And probably the only way to remove the coin, since I don't think it will be possible to remove it through the cutout. But it looks like the coin is just a little bit bigger than the cutout. Okay, I can't remove it through this hole, so I have to remove it through the bottom. So I have to remove the whole inner part. Okay, but it doesn't want to go any further okay so what else I can do probably there is no other options here okay so that's kind of complicated I have no idea what to do next oh now this part is locked what what happens I have no idea what has happened. It seems like there are some kind of pin or balls inside. It's more like a ball. Oh, and now it is unblocked. Okay, so probably when I remove it, tilt it, there is a ball that falls down. And when I tilt it the other way, it goes to the left and then I can move this part again okay but what's next it seems like that's it mm, and it's interesting i think it sounds like there there are more than one ball there 
maybe even two balls. Okay, but what I can do next? I can move this out, then it locked by the ball, and that's it. Okay, it doesn't feel like I can do anything, so the, I can do just a couple of moves. I can remove the inner part, I can tilt it and then it is blocked. So if there is a ball inside and Robrecht puzzles usually are based on a maze, so probably I have to move this ball through some kind of maze. I don't know where the ball is, but since it is falling down, so I can probably imagine that it's, it is somewhere here right now and maybe I have to move it through kind of maze to remove this part but it doesn't seem like I can do any moves it is kind of stuck let's make it very difficult Maybe if, if there are two balls, I have a feeling there are two balls. Since when I tilt it, it feels like there are a couple of balls falling down. So probably uh, it is going to be similar to, uh, to one of the puzzles made by, as I remember, Jean-Claude Constantin or Siebenstein Spiele where there were two balls and I had to make precise moves uh, to open the puzzle. And here maybe I have to move just a little bit and then the ball will go to the next corridor of the maze. No, it doesn't. Seems like that. Oh, maybe if there are two balls and the corridor is very small, one ball goes for example down, another stuck on the horizontal part and it is blocking the way so maybe I have to move it like this when the puzzle is blocked, I have to spin it and both balls will go different directions, one will stay here, another will go down, okay let's try. nothing happens. I can still move it only back, but I can't move it any further. Okay, now it is blocked. No, it doesn't help at all. Okay. upside down. I, I have no ideas. It is almost 10 minutes and I have no ideas what to do next. Maybe if I put it upside down there is a, I don't know, cut out in this part. The ball will fall there and that's how I can solve the puzzle. I have no ideas for now. Maybe I have to try an old trick if there is a magnet inside. Nothing happens. Let's try again. Nope. This way, this way I don't know if I have to do it, but nope. Okay, let's try again. Maybe I have to do it harder. Nope. Okay. Maybe like this. Nope, I don't think it helps at all. Oh, that was interesting. Finally, after 11 minutes, I've been able to find something. Okay, and now I see that 
the line that goes inside there is a maze it goes down to the right down so probably now i have to go somewhere else to remove it okay now i have to probably tilt it to move the ball that is hidden somewhere inside oh that's nice oh finally finally i've been able to remove the coin okay it took me 12 minutes 12 minutes and a little bit of luck to solve the puzzle okay there is a interesting cutout here I have no idea what is it for i can see the maze inside but i don't really see the whole maze and i have no idea what is happening inside what is the mechanics of the puzzle that makes it so difficult to find solution okay i have to put the coin back inside and lock it okay the puzzle is locked okay and this part where i was stuck for a while i think that i've been able to unstuck it only when i smack it really hard like this no not like this yeah okay so i ha you have to smack it from this side and then it unstuck so probably there is a magnet there and a small pin or a ball that holds it okay interesting puzzle escape from alcatraz that was my attempt to solve the escape from alcatraz puzzle as you could see it took me a lot of time just playing with the puzzle doing exactly the same moves again and again and again and then at a one moment i figure out the way uh, how to move forward and uh, then the rest of the puzzle is quite easy to solve you have just to tilt it left right to figure out the uh, way of the maze and that's it the puzzle will be solved but the most trickiest part is uh, to make the first move uh, which is quite difficult to find and i think probably a lot of people gonna spend hours uh, i think that i've been lucky to find this move so quick and uh, mm, i could spend as well like at least an hour or more trying to figure out and at the end probably i would be just using my tools to unscrew all four bolts and look inside to figure out what is happening there. If you like Escape from Alcatraz Puzzle and you want to buy it, as I told you, link in the video description. And if you enjoyed my video, hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not subscribed yet. And push the bell button to be notified every time I upload a new video. And now enjoy the small videos of all 17 puzzles that I got from Puzzle Master.